Well, I was nine when I started to play piano. My best friend, uh, Alexander, he had a piano. I fell in love first with the instrument and afterwards with the classical music itself. I always wanted to present uh, classical music in a little bit different way. You know, I thought that uh, presentation of classical music needs to be more adjusted for like 21st century and the way of life and the people living in this century. So I started to dress differently. I never liked like a black and white suits. And uh, then I started to change music itself. That's when I met my manager, Mel Bush, who was a pioneer of this kind of music, crossover music with a lot of artists before me. And uh, we started to do fusion of electronic music with classical. Now, obviously, I was a classical musician all my life, and that's my first love. But uh, I like electronic music in my free, in my spare time, to listen to electronic music, so I thought that fusion of this type of music could be something really, really interesting. I think we're planning to record another album and it's going to be released probably in autumn this year and later in the year, in December, I'm coming back with my band we are having 13 concerts in China. My first Yamaha was a Yamaha Clavinova. I think it's fascinating how, you know, the feel and the touch of a proper acoustic piano, it's fascinating and obviously it has so much advantages because it's much more compact than a, than a big piano. So like a lot of uh, students, a lot of people who can't, you know, obviously put the big pianos in, in their flats, you know, can. And not only me, but all of my colleagues, pianists were so impressed, you know, how it sounds and how it feels like a proper piano. So I'm really impressed. I have three Yamaha pianos myself. I have a Yamaha Clavinova, which was my first Yamaha. Then I bought a Yamaha Upright Silent. And then I bought a Conte Grand, but also silent. So. And I think there's uh, all different types, you know, for everyone, like all types of musician, whether you're a classical musician and you need like a, you know, electric piano which imitates like the acoustic piano, or in the same time, you know, if you like to experiment with the production and different sounds and different instruments, like what I do. So I think there's a big variety of different, you know, the type of Yamaha piano for everyone. This one is my favorite because I think it's the closest to the, to the, to the acoustic piano, you know, which I play of my concerts. For me, as a classical musician, this is something which is so close to, to the acoustic pianos and uh, it has a proper feel of, of acoustic piano and it's really it's a, you know, amazing thing to have. No, I think Shanghai is an amazing city, especially to do something like this, because obviously Shanghai has this uh, amazing combination of like a modern, you know, new and, and very old and traditional, obviously a lot of like a Western uh, influence mixed with obviously Eastern. So there's a, you know, a lot of interesting uh, atmospheres and combinations here in Shanghai, and I think it's a great, great city to do something like this. But it was really interesting. We had so, such an amazing location, like the one on the rooftop overlooking the moon, so 